So what is going on guys? Welcome back to my channel. And today I'm going to be showing you how to do a pop shove it on a fingerboard. Alright, well, I just did a few pop shove hits for you guys. They weren't the best, but a pop shove it is when you pop it and then shove it so it like uh, spins in the air. Pop and then twist, like pop twist, kind of. So, um, I'm going to show you guys how to do that, but first you want to get all of your the stuff out of the way and off your table or counter or your platform that you're doing it on but first when you're learning a new trick you want to clean off your grip tape if you have foam grip tape um you want to clean that off but if you have like rubber sandpaper grip tape that's fine you don't have to clean it off so I'm just gonna lay it on half the board so you guys see what it really does to it I'm using tape just to like stick it sometimes it doesn't stick that well doesn't really matter just keep rubbing it for a second and then <coughs> the tapes on there now I'm going to take it off and I don't know if you guys can see this, but that's where the tape wasn't. Right there. That's where the tape wasn't. Now I'm just going to finish cleaning it all off just like this. So it helps you learn and do the trick better if you have fresh clean grip tape all right maybe do it a couple more times if you want all right now my all of my grip tape is black well it was black before but you could see like the dust and stuff on it so now first i'm going to show you how to pop it you want to, okay, I'm going to show you how you want to hold it with, well, you aren't holding it, but you know, um, I'm a lefty, so I'm using it with my left hand and you want to have, you can use two or three fingers. I'll show for both your ring finger right here on the end, middle finger, like right there and then front finger pointer finger right there and then two fingers you want to have them your middle finger right here pointer finger right here in the middle and then I'm going to show you with the right I think it's supposed to be like this I don't know pointer finger right here middle finger right here it's like the opposite and then ring finger right here and then you just do this pointer finger and then middle finger for two fingers but I use three because I have small fingers and a small hand so it kind of helps a bit all right now I'm gonna show you how to pop it you want to pop it I just did a kick foot you want to pop it very well like keep you can pause the video just to pop it I'm popping it with my ring finger but if you're using two fingers you can pop it with your middle finger because I'm left-handed, but you can do it with your ring finger if you're using three fingers with your right hand, or pop it with your middle finger if you're popping it with two fingers and your right hand. All right, now 
done using three fingers, you want to pop. Just keep popping. So, yeah. And then, you want to kind of make your pointer finger, like, go down a little bit, like this. So, your nail's kind of going into the grip tape, but also not going into the grip tape. Like, your skin, sh your skin is on the grip tape, basically. Very hard. And then, you want to pop it, and then shove it. Go like this. Pop. You see how I'm flicking it, kind of? Like that. That's what you want. But if you're doing like this, that means you're either doing too much pop, or you're lifting your hand too high. So you just want to keep your hand at the same spot, kind of. Just put it up a little bit. See, my hand's above now. It's down, above, down, above. So now you want to pop, go like this. Pop, just like that. And when you're learning, you can go like and not popping it, but you want to pop it for the air, and it looks way cooler, so just pop it, like, just like this. Just like that. And you can also check your progress if you get a couple of like books, you can go like this and try to do an ollie and a thing at the same time. And after this video, go watch how to do it in ollie because it shows a lot there if you haven't already. Just keep going like that. Try to get it on it. So, like, it's hard, but then when you're on, you can also get off of it. When you're on, you can do a pop shove it to get off. Just like that. Alright, now, since you know how to do a pop shove it, you can get your skate park, your fingerboard skate park. And do an ollie and then put it all together. And just like that. It's really easy. You just gotta practice a whole lot. And yeah. So now I will see you in the next video. Peace. Woo!